Welcome to episode 9 of Marathon Training in Iten, Kenya with Luis Orta. We are doing a medium long run today, 25k in an hour and a half. Today is a very rainy day, difficult conditions, but when you are serious about training, it doesn't matter if it rains, you have to get it done. Today we start in a different spot because we're going to go on a different route and this hotel that we're in front of is Wilson Kipsang's hotel, a good friend of mine. I met him the first time I was in Kenya, pretty cool guy and very successful runner and entrepreneur. Super, super nice hotel. So if you guys ever go to Iten, uh, know that one of the options is to stay at Kelu Hotel of Wilson Kipsang and maybe you'll be able to meet him because he's always there. All right, good morning everybody. Good morning, good morning. Another day in beautiful Iten, Kenya. Yeah. <laughs> uh, today we're gonna do another medium long run. Uh, today is Wednesday, so we're gonna get around 25 kilometers or so, depending on how we feel. Start easy and then progress. If we feel good, we go a little faster at the end. If we are tired from yesterday workout, we can keep it under control. Uh, so let's be smart and have fun with it. Let's do it. This route is pretty hard. You start climbing. I feel like at three kilometers, like two miles, you start going up. And then we probably went up for an hour and 15 minutes. So a long time of climbing and then it started raining really hard as well. So it was going up, plus the rain, plus it was windy, plus we were going fast. So it was definitely a hard day. So in Kenya they have two seasons, which is rainy season and dry season. And during the rainy season we trained pretty well. There was some puddles here and there and some muddy roads, but they also have the tarmac, like the asphalt road, so you can train no problem, you can get it done. And then in the summer it just get very dusty, so that's why you see all the runners like brown after they finish their runs, just because the dirt gets everywhere. This was one of my favorite workouts. I, I think I've said this before, but this was a lot of fun because it was raining so hard and the guys just kept going, kept pushing, kept running hard. And I felt good. I was tired for sure, but I was feeling good. I was feeling strong and I was able to run progressive. 
and I was very happy with the time at the end and I was very happy to feel healthy, confident, strong and getting fitter and better each day. So it was definitely a good training session, definitely a good run and I was very happy with it. You can see how hard it was raining, but it was fun. I like it. I enjoy it. I don't see it as a bad thing. I see it as like, you know, a hurdle that you have to go through and just enjoy it. Like running in Africa under this rain and we were running pretty hard. Like it's awesome. It's a dream come true for me. We went down to 310 per kilometer, which is like 502 per mile. So pretty fast at the end, especially with the rain, especially on a difficult day like today, but definitely a good workout. <coughs> Another solid day in Kenya. 25k going up, up, up. And then finishing progressive hard. Last K in 310. So we're definitely moving at the end. But feeling good. Thank you all for the help. Well done, guys. <laughs> it was so hard, eh? it was silly. Dig it, dig it, dig it. It rained the entire time. It rained really hard too. The thing that we do when it's raining hard is that we make sure to get the effort in and then go home and shower with hot water for Maji Moto in Swahili and then rest up maybe some hot tea or hot, hot coffee and then you know rest up and wait for the second session of the day but it doesn't matter if it's hot if it's cold if it's raining you gotta get training done stay tuned for another episode coming up next week remember to like comment share and subscribe thank you